Welcome to the World Tarot. This is going to be a reading for Cancer Divine Feminine for the month of October. And this reading is meant to be for the people who need this reading the most for October from the Cancer Divine Feminine Collective. Holy Spirit, who needs this reading the most for October from the Divine Feminine, the Cancer Divine Feminine Collective? Holy Spirit, show me the person or people who need this reading the most for October from the Cancer Divine Feminine Collective, please. Who needs this reading the most from the Cancer Divine Feminine Collective, please, Holy Spirit? Oh. Pilot Kevin, Jean-Claude. Wow. Feel that gentle, easy glide. Relax and try not to worry that Kevin has no idea how to land this plane. Jean-Claude. Jean-Claude and his giant lobster claw are out for revenge. So, either you want to take revenge or some, on someone or someone else is trying to take revenge on you. Maybe because, maybe you're too light-hearted. Maybe this is like your enemy. I don't know if it's you out for revenge. Because ca cancers usually are the ones who give a lot of love to people. They're very, they, they're overly patient with people. So let's see here. It's like maybe you're you you go with the flow, right? Because it says here, feel that gentle, easy glide, relax, and try not to worry that Kevin has no idea how to land this plane. So it's like going with the flow. It's not really doing what you're not really knowing what you're doing, just going with the flow, right? And here, um, Jean Claude is out for revenge. This could be someone else, actually. This could be someone you're dealing with. Who's causing issues for you because these are very different energies actually it's this one's very innocent it's like i'm just do, doing me and I, i'm not bothering anyone but this guy is like taking revenge is mad at you but you see it has a lobster claw which is very weird because it's for the sign of cancer that's very interesting i just realized now jean claude and his giant lobster claw are out for revenge maybe you are mad at somebody Maybe uh, someone um, uh, took advantage of your kindness and took it for, for weakness and you, you might be mad now. Holy Spirit. Too quickly. Holy Spirit, what does this Cancer Divine Feminine need to hear? Holy Spirit, what does this Cancer Divine Feminine need to hear? Maybe you have air in your chart too. It's like Cancer and some air sign Holy Spirit Who is this divine feminine who needs this uh, cancer divine feminine who needs the reading right now who is this cancer divine feminine who needs a reading right now Holy Spirit Who is the cancer divine feminine who needs this reading right now Queen of Wands so this is fire Queen of Wands reversed so you're very mad at something. Somebody somebody pushed your buttons too much and you're you're angry. You could also be doing some kind of magic maybe against someone who hurt you or sending back someone's magic. Holy spirit. Oh god. What's happening here? It's coming out they're coming out too much like that. Ace of Cups reverses like a lack of love. Maybe you offered love to someone and it's like they uh, spilled your cup. King of Pentacles. So this could be a man you're dealing with, possibly. Five of Cups. And there's a lot of grief and sorrow over this situation. Two of Swords reversed. It's like you made a decision. Maybe you just made a decision to stop taking any kind of abuse from other people. And you're angry. Uh, you might be like passive-aggressive. You might have taken a lot of BS un until you couldn't take it anymore and now you um, like flip the script on someone. It could be. Holy Spirit, who is the King of Pentacles here? Who is this King of Pentacles? Three of Pentacles reversed. Could be of ex-husband, I think. Three of Wands. And they live at a distance, maybe. Seven of Pentacles. Seven of Pentacles. 
So this is either someone you, you had a relationship with uh, or you worked with. This could also be your father. And um, you may have distanced yourself from this person. You may have moved away from this person. Either that or you're waiting for this person to come towards you, to come back to you. You may have been waiting for a long time for this person to return to you. Holy Spirit, is this man planning on returning to this feminine? So with the King of Pentacles, this could be your Divine Masculine. You could have been waiting for your Divine Masculine. You could have been waiting for Twin Flame Union for a long time. So is this Masculine coming towards this Feminine? Holy Spirit, is this Masculine coming back towards this Feminine? Holy Spirit, is this Masculine coming back towards the Feminine? Does he have any intention on coming towards the Feminine? Holy Spirit, does this Masculine... Knight of Swords, yes he does, very quickly, probably very quickly. Uh, you may have waited a long time, but it's like now it's happening, it's actually happening soon. Seven of Cups, uh, they might promise a lot of things when they return. Uh, they might try to confuse you, uh, overwhelm you with the plans that they're making. They might want to move fast. Five of Swords. This may end up in an argument, actually. And this person's like, they want to win at all costs. They're coming very swiftly. And uh, maybe they feel like this is like a sure victory or something like that. Or they want revenge, right? Because Knight of Swords with the Five of Swords makes me think of a similar energy to the Jean-Claude energy. So even though this looks like cancer because he's got the claw, um, this may be the other person coming back um with bad intentions maybe you were mad at this person maybe you told this person off you walked away from this person or they walked away from you and now they want to come back for revenge that's kind of what i'm getting unfortunately uh why does this person want revenge holy spirit why does this person this man want revenge on this feminine holy spirit why does this man want revenge on this feminine Because of Eight of Cups reversed. Maybe they want to come back and the feminine doesn't want them back anymore. That could be. Three of Swords, they're heartbroken now, all of a sudden. Or maybe there's a third party. Maybe you're moving into another relationship and they're trying to stop you from moving away from them, from moving on. My ears are making a lot of noise now. Seven of Swords, sneaky. So this person might be doing a lot of things behind your back. They might be plotting something and planning and you don't even know. What are they planning? What's this person plotting and planning here? Oh, the King of Cups reversed, obviously. So they want to manipulate you. They might pretend that they love you, but they don't love you, right? They might try to manipulate you into thinking that they love you and they don't. Also, if you have someone, they might um, they might deter this person. They might lie to this person, actually, about something regarding you. They might say that you cheated on them or something. So they can uh, push away the competition, right? Holy Spirit. The full reversed. Again, they want to keep you stuck. They don't want you to, to, to have a new beginning. That's the thing here. Not without them. But I don't even know if this person actually wants to be with you. Does this person actually uh, want to be with you? Do they want to have a relationship with you here? Does this man want to have a relationship with you? No, of course not. Yeah, It's clear now. Nine of Swords reversed. Two of Wands. They're, they're just... Um, trying to get something out of their mind, out of their system. They, they want to get over anxiety over something. They don't want to be with you, but they want to release some kind of anxiety. And they might want to travel to you or with you somewhere to blow off some steam, basically, to release some tension, I think. What does this person want with the Cancer Divine Feminine? Holy Spirit, what does this man want with Cancer Divine Feminine? 
Queen of Pentacles reversed, they might want to rob you. Maybe they see that you've grown, that you financially you're doing better than them. And they want to take your money. Or they if they if they have financial issues themselves, they, they want to kind of live off of you. They want to use you with the Queen of Pentacles reversed. They might even treat you like a prostitute. They might take you somewhere on, on holiday and uh, take advantage of you, basically. Three of Cups. They might want to have a threesome with you. They, they might want to, yeah, they want to drink and have fun with you. And, to, uh, yeah, kind of treat you like a prostitute, to be honest. This is pretty horrible. Ten of Swords reversed. I think because they don't want you to... To end it with them completely. Two of Cups reversed. But they don't want the relationship either. So they don't want you to let go of them energetically. You, they want, don't want you to cut them off for good. But they don't want a relationship with you either. You see how the two of... The, the Seven of Swords, Ten of Swords came together. Now the King of Cups reversed with the Two of Cups reversed. So definitely this person doesn't love you. And they don't want to have a relationship. They just want to have some fun. <sighs> yeah. Holy Spirit, how should you um, how should you act when this person comes towards you? Because they want to come towards you, definitely. So how should you how should the Cancer Divine Feminine, the Fool, the Five of Wands reversed? Maybe you shouldn't do anything because the Fool is zero. Five of Wands reversed is not not arguing with them, not competing for their attention. Just say bye, basically. You see how the Fool looks like he's saying bye bye. And the fool is zero, so do nothing. And don't don't allow this person to trigger you into so starting some kind of argument with them. And don't let them um, don't let them put you in third party situations. Don't let them make you compete for them. Because this person, I think they, I think they, you know, cancers tend to give a lot of energy, a lot of love, and narcissists do tend to be attracted to to their energy. So this person doesn't feel your energy anymore and they want your energy. They want your attention. So yeah, in, in a lot of cancer readings, when I haven't done uh, the zodiac sign reading in, in a lot of time, in a long time, but in the cancer reading I always get this kind of... Uh, yeah. So th yeah, this person cares a lot about uh, having a lot of attention from a lot of people, like I was saying. They need the attention. They, it's like their fuel, the fuel to their fire. Eight of Wands reversed. Uh, that probably there's no contact with this person. So like once they get the attention they need, they go no contact. They ghost you. Ten of Pentacles. Maybe this person even has a family with someone else and that you don't know of. Two of Pentacles reversed. Yeah, there's an imbalance. This is not uh, this is unrequited, basically. Four of Swords reversed, and there's no healing in this situation. This person doesn't want to heal the situation. They don't want to have a balanced relationship with you. Four of Cups. Yeah, this is like a rejection. They're they're rejecting you, and they're walking away. So that's what you should do, actually, to to them. You should reject them and walk away from them because they're just coming to to have a good time with you and probably not to treat you well with the queen of pentacles reversed they're not even gonna treat you well knight of cups you might get a love offer from someone else or you need to take your uh, idealistic heart away from this person or if you have a child you need to move away with your child from this person yeah block them defend yourself protect yourself and your family that's that's clearly here. That's the message here. You see how I put this right in front of this Knight of Swords? Like the block is boom, just in front of him. And he's coming in quick. So don't, don't even answer him. Maybe you shouldn't even like answer them if they call you or if they... I don't know, if they come to your door, don't open the door. <laughs> yeah, free yourself. See? Eight of Swords reversed. Free yourself. Knight of Wands reversed. They, they just want to have fun with you, basically. They'll, they're they're going to be in and out. And like I said, they might want to take you on holiday somewhere. Or they... Yeah. Yes. King of Swords. But this person is very cold and detached. 
So they're gonna cut you off the moment they get what they want. That's the, the same message over and over again. With the Six of Cups here, you might have children with this person. Maybe you had children with this person. Maybe you've known this person for a very long time, maybe since childhood. Maybe they remind you of someone from your childhood, you know? And that's why there's this huge... Or this is a soulmate from a past life. So there's a huge trauma bond with this person. It's very hard to let go of them. And now the noise started. Okay, <laughs> well, the reading's over anyway. I hope this helps. Have a good day. Take care.